Comparing the environmental impact of different products is becoming increasingly important, and the EPD, Environmental Product Declaration, is a global standard that makes this possible. By describing a product's environmental impact from a life cycle perspective in an objective and transparent way that has undergone independent verification, an EPD is the most credible way to convey information about the environmental performance of products or services. To create an EPD for your product, you need to follow these five steps, which usually take 2 to 12 months. Step 1. Select your product category rules, also called PCR. All products affect the environment in different ways. Therefore, there are various ways to calculate the environmental impact, which is reflected in a PCR. PCR is a document that provides the instructions for how the life cycle assessment should be conducted. These are collected in the PCR library for the product category in question. If there is no PCR suitable for the product category, a new one can be developed. Step 2. Conduct a life cycle assessment study, also called LCA study. Through an LCA study, information is produced that describes the environmental impact of a product or service during its entire life cycle, from raw material to waste or recycled material. An LCA study can be produced either within the organization or by an external consultant. External consultants are listed on our website. An LCA study usually takes between 1 and 12 months. Step 3. Compile the information. When the LCA study is complete, the results are summarized in an EPD format. Guidelines for this can be found on our website. An organization can create this on its own or enlist the help of a consultant. Step 4. Third-party verification. The EPD and all associated documents undergo third-party verification by an individual verifier or accredited certification body. Verifiers must be approved by EPD International. The review takes approximately two weeks, resulting in a report on how the EPD met the mandatory requirements. Step 5. Registration and Publishing. In the final step, the request for publication of the EPD is sent through the EPD portal. The organization registers the EPD and associated documents in the EPD portal for a final review. If there are no additions needed, the EPD is approved, published and made freely available on the website. Now you have a ready-made EPD that can be used in many contexts, knowing that you have a transparent, comprehensive and independently verified product declaration.